It's a lifestyle for the rough and rugged kind The tougher the game, the longer the pain, the better the ride We do what we can to stay ahead Cause the modern world wants us left for dead You better believe as long as we breathe The sun's gonna rise We dig real deep, try a little harder Buckle down tight, go a little farther So we can look back and be proud of what we've done Sometimes we gotta work under the gun Don't sweat the battle, make sure the war's won Keep on keeping on, cause the bottom line It's a labor of love we call the grind The Grind Waterfowl TV is brought to you by Canadian Waterfowl Supplies, Dakota Decoy, premium gunning decoys for demanding hunters, Lucky Duck Premium Decoys, Masters of Deception, Heavy Shot, I didn't come this far to miss, Wild Ear, custom fit hearing protection and enhancement. Delta Waterfowl, the Duck Hunters Organization, Pro Drive Shallow Water Outboards, Camp Chef, the way to cook outdoors, Sitka Gear, turning clothing into gear, and these fine sponsors. Hey everyone, just got back from a great hunt this morning. I'm gonna check on the turkey right now. It's been uh, sitting on the camp chef here on uh, high smoke. It's about around 150 degrees. Uh, we put it on around five o'clock this morning, so we're gonna open it up, take a look, and see where it's at, and check the internal temperature. Right now, looks like it's at about 106 degrees, so we're looking pretty good. I'm gonna open it up. We've got golden brown going on right now. I think it's really moist. I think we're gonna eat really well the next couple of hours. So. weekend so we are on a public area so there's quite a few hunters out day after Thanksgiving um, supposed to be a beautiful day I think we're gonna hit 50 degrees should have light variable maybe south winds Mikey's gonna have the wind and the Sun at his back he's a happy camper this morning so we're gonna go give him heck see what we can do already one to nothing and I know because I'm ahead of everybody else doing this <laughs> hey 
Hey everyone, Ricky Hart here with Lucky Duck. I want to talk to you about our new Lucky HD for 2015. This is something that we've worked a long time on and we're very excited to announce this year and it should be available this summer. It's made out of an EVA blended plastic, very tough. We went to an actual carver, had it carved like an actual duck and you can see the paint scheme on it is very realistic. The nice thing about the EVA blend, again, is the durability. Something that if you, you're setting it up in the morning and you drop it on the ground, you can pick it right up. You're not gonna hurt this decoy. The next great feature about this decoy is how everything is built to be operated externally on this decoy. Right here on the chest, we actually have the cutout for the Lucky HD receiver if you have a remote kit. And then you also have a charging port here. And then the battery actually clips right into the decoy just like that. So it's very easy, very efficient. We actually went to a two position switch this year. So if you actually turn the decoy on, the nice thing is, is that if you have a remote, you can just hit that off button and it'll shut right off. Easy chest mount. Goes right on the three piece 42 inch stake that comes with the decoy. And it's attached with the bungee. So it's very easy to pull out of the ground, move. You can throw it right over your back and move right around with it and stick it right in the ground with no issues. Durable magnetic wings that snap right in. That's a Lucky HD for 2015. Well, we're gonna wrap up day four out here in South Dakota. It turned out to be kind of a bust. Um, the weatherman crossed us up with winds. We were hoping for a south wind and we got set up and actually the ducks are flying late today. So about the time we started seeing ducks, the wind spun around and got us right in the face. So we're really just gonna regroup. We're gonna pick decoys up. We're gonna go do some work on my hunting boat and we're gonna get ready for morning and we're gonna go after them again. We'll see what we can get done. I'm a fifth generation South Dakotan, been hunting since 1953, November 11. I had two favorite uncles that basically ruined my kid brother and I on hunting because we shot 20 ducks that day and uh, rode out on a homemade wooden boat. I uh, had a little fire on the bottom of the boat, uh, you know, coffee can, we made cocoa from scratch. And this is my 61st first year, so uh, really happy to be able to still do it. So, been hunting this reach of the river for a while, got a great hunting partner, and uh, been really fortunate that way. Broke in South Dakota. Gotta love it. One to one.
Nice, beautiful double curls. Boys in full bloom. Very nice, healthy ducks. Welcome to Delta Waterfowl's Conservation Corner. I'm Frank Rohr. I'm the president of Delta Waterfowl. We're, we're here today on the prairies and, and in this season of the Grind Waterfowl TV, we're going to talk about the things Delta Waterfowl does for ducks and for duck hunters across North America. Delta Waterfowl is the duck hunters organization and duck production is what it's about for hunters. I, I don't know of any hunters that have seen too many ducks in their decoys. We'd all like to see more ducks. And so that's why Delta focuses on this prairie pothole region, because it's duck production that drives populations and managing production here on the prairies is what Delta is all about. So as the Duck Hunters Organization, we see it as our role to, to try and address the problems ducks face on the prairies. Well, we're going to have some sweet rolls here for the boys as soon as we figure out how to open this container. When we get this going, we're going to drop this on our camp shelf equipment and have uh, something to help the boys with their sweet tooth today. Roll number one. Just let that warm up so that when the rolls are done, 16, 18 minutes from now, we'll be able to at least top them off with something sweet. And that should help out with all the little empty tummies that are in the blind today. That's my thoughts on it, right? Look at that. That's good. Mm -hmm. You know what even makes it better? Got my own private stash of butter. Nice shooting, boy. Well, that was fun. That was really fun. <laughs> We are just shot a lemon of mallards, windy day, 
weren't sure we were going to do very well because they get kind of squirrely in the wind, but uh, we had a strong northwest wind. There's quite a few ducks around. We got some to cooperate and we scratched out a limit of ducks. And now we're cleaning these babies up, getting some beautiful breast meat here, and Patrick's going to make us some duck jerky. Mm -hmm. Okay, you can see what the, the weather's gotten colder here in the Dakotas and the ducks have found the corn. These are the kind of ducks we like shooting because they come in and they make your call sound really good because they're thirsty. <laughs> <laughs> so you, typically we see these when they're coming, they're so thirsty that we are, you hear them before you see them, just in time to grab your call and you can say we called those ducks right to the water. Those are the easiest decoy ducks in the world. Okay, here we are. We're actually, days are running together. I believe we're on day five, South Dakota. Um, it's a weekend. You can probably hear banging behind us. We're hunting a public area, so there's lots of hunters out on the weekend. Um, they're calling for a west wind, but right now we have no wind, so we're setting up for a west wind. If it does come up a little bit, it should be perfect. We should have some sun at our back. Um, there's a lot of ducks in the area still. They're getting gun shy. They've been here for about two weeks. Uh, so it's a little tip. I mean, it's gonna take some lighter calling today. I think we're gonna have calm winds. Um, we'll get on the ducks hard when they're off in the distance to try and get their attention. Once they start working the spread, we go down to a minimal of calling. Just a couple of clucks and some highballs. So we'll see what happens. We're getting the decoy set. We should be rolling here in about 15 minutes. Sounds like some guys already are. Those two are lined up, and I, I can tell you right now, I guarantee all four of us shot right in the center of those two. <laughs> I guarantee yep. it. That was awesome. That we was cool. <laughs> we got four. We did it. We did it. That okay. was cool. <laughs> that worked out pretty darn good. We needed four drakes to finish up here, and we had a nice little bunch of what, 30? Yeah. yeah. And the first four that peeled off and dove in were four drakes. <laughs> so that finished us up for the day. Day five. South Dakota, Mikey was finally epic, what I've been promising you for three days. And look what time of the day it is. And it's 10 o'clock. I'd say it's just time for breakfast. It's yeah. time for breakfast. Well, we're wrapping up day five here in South Dakota and daubers were a little low this morning. There were a lot of ducks moving. We had a no wind situation, so they weren't acting quite right. Um, we waited them out uh, as the ducks, of course, coming back from the field are always a little easier to decoy and it turned into one whale of a shoot. Um, still not much wind so they were kind of coming behind us from the side of us but they were landing right in the hole they were sucking right to the lucky ducks it was it was pretty cool pretty 
epic day as I was trying to get Mikey to believe in me and I think he finally believed in me. So a good day here in South Dakota. It's a lifestyle for the rough and rugged kind The tougher the game, the longer the pain, the better the ride We do what we can to stay ahead Cause the modern world wants us left for dead You better believe as long as we breathe The sun's gonna rise We dig real deep, try a little hard Buckle down tight, go a little farther so we can look back and be proud of what we've done. Sometimes we gotta work under the gun, don't sweat the battle, make sure the war is won. Keep on keeping on, cause the bottom line, it's a labor of love we call the grind. Visit our website, www.thegrindwaterfowl.com, where you will find past episodes as well as tips and tactics from the boys here at The Grind. Follow The Grind on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, and YouTube.